What is going on, YouTube? This is Gavin21202, aka Gavin Orlando here, bringing you all the latest WWE news, rumors, headlines, and updates. As you might be able to hear, I'm watching SmackDown Live right now. But I am bringing you all the latest WWE news in regards to The Rock's return on WWE last night at Monday Night Raw. Although he did not return on air, he was on the show and before Raw aired and after Raw aired. Because before Raw aired, this happened. Vince McMahon, quote-unquote, fires The Rock before WWE Raw. The Rock had been backstage at Raw all day working on screen on scenes for Fighting With My Family, a film about the real life of WWE superstar Paige and her wrestling family. Many were speculating that the Great One would make an appearance on tonight on last night's show, but instead he graced the live audience by sharing special pre-show moment with Vince McMahon. Thanks to the Staples Center crowd, we now know that The Rock appeared on the crowd shortly before Raw went off the air to film a few shots for the movie. It's unknown how the footage will be used, but cameras were rolling as the People's Champ entered the arena. The Rock cut a promo for the crowd and joked about not uh, casting John Cena in the in it because it's a good movie. Then Vince McMahon's music hit and Vince came out to the ring to fire The Rock and walk the former WWE champion off stage. We also learned that tonight that Stone Cold was backstage at Raw, and yet it was it was. And yet it was starting to appear that neither of WWE Hall of Famers will appear on television. The Rock will be back after the show to film the scene in the movie which will feature Paige defeating AJ Lee for the WWE Divas Championship. And you can listen to the comicbook.com over the ropes podcast in the link in the description below. So now let's move on to what happened after Raw, the thing of the video. And that was that The Rock had called former WWE superstar CM Punk from Raw. He literally took his phone out and called CM Punk. Dwayne The Rock Johnson hasn't appeared on WWE in a WWE ring since WrestleMania 32 last April. CM Punk hasn't appeared in a WWE ring since he left the company in 2014 at the Royal Rumble. But both men nearly shared a moment together in WWE ring Monday night. Johnson made an appearance before and after Raw tapings from the Staples Center in Los Angeles because he was filming the scene for an upcoming movie he's producing on the career of WWE wrestler Paige titled Fighting With My Family. When the TV taping ended, a match took place between the two actors recreating Paige winning the WWE Divas Championship from Punk's wife AJ Lee in 2014. Ha uh ha. Hey, you sound so freaking out, but at the rock leaves that CM Punk a voicemail. When Lee was announced, the crowd started chanting loudly for CM Punk. Hearing the cheers, Johnson called his one time opponent. Johnson won the WWE Championship at the 2013 Royal Rumble. Unfortunately for Johnson and the fans inside the arena, the call went right to voicemail, and the actor left a message. Wanting to please the fans, Johnson took it all a step further and tried to FaceTime CM Punk, but was unsuccessful. Where would the UFC fighter be at 10.25 p.m.? Being a good animal owner, because he said on his Twitter, I'm walking Larry, it's his birthday. He went on to thank his fans inside the home of the Los Angeles Clippers, Lakers, and the Kings. Thank you, Los Angeles. Nice to hear from you at the Staples Center. So does this signal the possibility of Punk returning to WWE? It's highly unlikely as Punk is looking to have another fight in UFC in 2017. So, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to bring you all the latest WWE news, rumors, headlines, and updates. I'm going to you guys to like this video, favorite this video, share this on every social media platform that's only possible. Go pledge me at Patreon.com. Check out my Patreon words in the link in the description below. And do me one last thing and definitely subscribe. Thanks, guys. Love y'all.